Seems like everyone's getting to work just fine. Everyone's got some goods to sell. What's going on, everyone? My name is Diesel, and I design stuff in City Skylines today. What's going on, players? How you doing? You feeling good? Good. Good. Last episode, we mastered the art of the, indus the industrial zone. Yes. Everything's moving in one way, one uniform fashion, the way it should be. The way that you like it, the way that you need it. Inside your city. Indeed. What you building there, homie? What you building there? Something with a, something with a smokestack? I don't think it's gonna be a big building. It's like it's gonna like be super big and stuff. Let's see what you got. What you got? What you got? What's up? Fantastic. Looks like a looks like a box factory. Probably is. Who am I to judge? You know. So, like I said last episode, we finished up our industrial zone. We gave it a little residency. We gave uh, residential people their, uh, what they want, what they need. And it seems like it's working out just fine because there's no more, uh, need more goods to sell at all in the city. I'm so smart. It's confirmed. That's what you gotta do. You gotta make yourself some industrial zones so all the peoples will love you and enjoy it. Yes. Yes. So what are we gonna do today? Well, we got the golf course area. We have the sports district area over here. I have a feeling this is gonna be another little entertainment area. A little entertainment area for, for people to enjoy. Not too big, nothing too crazy because we have... You know, this beach area over here. Just something a little fun for all the uh, the locals, the residents. We've got a golf course. It's just fine. Yeah, so over here, we're going to build up a little bit of an area. So, yeah, I said area. Let's just, let's just, you know, pop this one back out there. Good. Now, what do we got going on over here? We got a little burger joint. We got quiet corner shop. But you know what we need? You know what this town needs? Go-kart tracks. Let's do it. Right on the corner. Right on the corner. Fifth and Main. Bang! We'll pop that bad boy down. Of course you need water. Of course you need water. It's like the one thing that's constant throughout all my cities. Oh, uh, what seems to be the problem here? Uh, no water. People are thirsty. Oh, okay. Good, 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 good. Good. Check out this. This is a fun little model. Now, the real question is, is do go-karts race on it? Probably not. That's a bummer, man. Racing tracks, though. You know, it's a nice little model, though. Something different for your city to have. A couple views. Got repairs. Good stuff. I swear to you, though, if go-karts start racing on that, it's going to be tight. It's going to be tight like a toyker. So, let's check out what we can put alongside of this. Why not put some, you know, a little parking area. A little parking area for everyone. Okay. Okay. And then over here, we'll get a, we'll find a vending machine. Let's find a vending, sweet, sweet vending machines. Sweet, sweet, Tropic Thunder. Sweet, sweet love. I think it's like, I think the uh, soda pop is called the Tropic. Because when it hits your lips, it's so cold, so ice, so cold. What's your hits your lips? What's it hits your lips so cold? I'm gonna do one. Just one. Just gonna do one. Fountain Plaza. Still no search bar, no mod, no creator has come up with something yet. Any machine square, what's up? Bang. Bangarang. And we got some vending machines. Some parking spaces. Everyone's gonna be happy. Everyone's gonna be racing. We are living life at its highest point. Craziness. It's good. It's very good. Now I'm gonna do my best to try and keep this area kind of beachy, even though it's not really that beachy as you can see. Maybe uh, throw some couple buildings in here. Nothing too crazy. Let's do some like commercial. You know, nothing too over the top. Fill in the industry because we do have a commercial demand, and now we, that we have goods to sell, I don't see why we can't. Just throw some commercial in here and make everyone happy. Let's speed up the process a little bit. Let's see what happens. We're going to be doing a couple things in here. Oh, I thought I could have sworn I saw some go-karts there. I could have sworn it. I could have. Now, since we're doing a little bit of a go-kart racing, that's a business, you know. Let's uh, let's build it up a little bit. Let's make some, some commercial around it. And I don't know why I zoned in uh, that area behind these because nothing will ever grow there which is unfortunate that's unfortunate whenever you I, I mentioned this in an earlier video but whenever you have one of these little street things here these little parking spaces 
and you zone behind it, nothing ever grows there. Nothing will ever go in there. Your city will not be happy with it. Yay. Let's build some offices right there. Fantastic. Now, do we have anything fun? Something fun. Even though go-karts are super fun, super fantastic, super lovely. We do have an amusement park, but I don't think I want to put an amusement park here. We, can, we, you know, we got plenty of amusement parks. A mall, on the other hand. That might be something. That might be something that takes a ticket, you know what I mean? Where? What? What, what is this? Okay, those are all commercials, so we can do that. We don't have a mall in this area, so we need a mall. We need places to pe for people to go shop. There's plenty of boutiques and everything. The Mall of America, right there. Now we need some parking lots to fill it in to make it look like it is a part of something. Because we just can't have uh, a business that doesn't have parking. I mean, that's silly. That's ridiculous. I mean, why wouldn't you have parking to bring people in? Why would you park with people on the streets? Can't be have, can't be chilling with people on the streets. Ah, na 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 na. I'm from the streets. I don't know why I wanted to master P out of all the things I could have come up with. Small secure car park. Nah, nah not so much. Parking space. Let's see over here. What we got over here? Parking 4x4 four four or 7 cars. That's good. And let's do a little road around here. Let's do a little road. A little road. Can I go through there? I sure can. Perfect. It's perfect, I said. Perfect. Good, good. Yes. Now, let's fill in some parking spaces around the mall area here. And then we will have a walkway. Go from here down to there. Connecting it all up. Almost like I know what I'm doing a little bit. Almost. Not quite. Kinda, sorta. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. Let's put some trees around here. Maybe not so big. Let's put some trees. Kaka! Kaka! Still, the seagulls are real here in the city of Tropico Paradise. Yes. That looks quite. That looks, that looks quite good. Quite quaint. Quite, quite quaint. Kaka! Kaka! Marr! see what else we can throw down here in our little mall area. Now, I know there's uh, different kinds of uh, buildings that can pop up. I think we just kind of have to put another little, little commercial zone. Just fill it in with some offices to round out the top ten. Yes. Very good, very good, yeah. Very good. No water? Whatever. We need people, man. Oh, yeah? We'll suck it up for right now, man. We got plenty of places for people to go. Just no one wants to move in. Not a high demand, if you will. Now, let's see. Actually, you know, no, 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 no. We're going to go all the way to the end. I'm going to put another baseball field in here. Get some parks going. Get the park situation up. Can I put this over here? Can I? Ooh, it looks like I can. Could there. We're going to pop that bad boy right in the center. We might have taken out some homes. But then, you know what? That's fine. Because we got a basketball cart. Ca cart? Cart? No, not a cart. A court. So we'll throw in all the uh, residential around here. Kind of like, a, you know, just a little residential field. I guess we're going to have to put a parking space over there because that's kind of a big deal. Big people will be coming in from far and wide to check out their son play baseball. Or daughter play baseball, you know. Get a little, uh... uh who's the uh, the baseball player from Philly? Uh, the, the little the little leaguer. Um, Monet Davis. Get a little Monet Davis action. Daughter throwing some hot heat. Get it done. You know what I'm saying? As long as you got the power, go right ahead. Strike on uh, some people's out. Where's the parking lot? I'm telling you, the UI mod for like a search mod would be 
super duper dope. I know exactly where it is now. I hate where I know all the things are after I've gone all the way to the end. Where are you at? Parking lot. Small secure parking lot? No. Parking space? No. 4x4 four four parking. Hmm. Really? What if I... Yeah. So we're just gonna have to do it like that. Parking lot. And I suppose what we'll do here is we will make a road that goes across the way here to kind of segment this kind of area off as like a little sporting facility. Just a little tiny sports facility. Nothing too crazy. Nothing too cray cray. As a matter of fact, let's see if we can put any schools. Can we put any high schools? Do we need high schools? No, we're actually pretty good over here, surprisingly. Uh, okay, so let's throw in something. Just trying to think on the top of my head what I got here. What I, what I got. Maybe a tennis club? Can we throw a tennis club in there? And then we'll just throw an extra parking lot in and we'll just make it a big little tiny mini, not a big tiny, a big tiny mini. It makes no sense. It's just double negatives all over. Big tiny mini. No, nope, those are all not correct. These are understandable, understandable. I get it, I get it. Right, right. Uh, I know I got some most stuff. Let's make some little parks and such, you know? Park with trees, large playground. No, too big. Golf course is definitely too big. I gotta get rid of these golf course assets. Just the one that I like. And that's the tropical one. Fountain Plaza. There we go. There we go. There we go. And what else do we have here? 8x1 parking. No, tropical park updated. No, no, I don't want to do that. It's too big. It's too big. It's so big, you know. Vending machine area. We need some vending machines. For all of the people who are going to be requiring sports drinks. And sustenance. Is this again? Palm brush strip. Mm. Small container yard. There we go. Urban food forest. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. Can I put this anywhere? And you know what? That'll just have to do for now. There we go. A little sports park for everyone. And uh, people will eventually, you know, move in. And we got nice houses and homes right behind a baseball field. Unless someone hits a home run, then you're going to have some broken windows, son. Listen, I didn't tell you to move in there. I just said, hey, it's a pretty cool place. You'd probably enjoy it. Let's make it pretty. Keep it nice. Keep it pretty. What do we got for transportation? Do we have any bus stations over here? Oh, water. These people need water. Of course. Boom. Fantastic. What else can we put over here? Nope. We're going to keep going down the let's fill we're gonna fill this bad boy in. we're gonna fill this in with all kinds of good stuff good feelings good vibes all low density residential we're gonna put a couple things across the way from the sports park some shops some things like that in case you want to eat something eat some dinner after your baseball game after the little league game you're like yo let's go get some pizza for the team or like a snow cone or something like that and you don't want to drive all the way down here. You can just come on over here. Get some get some nice restaurants going. Yeah, why not? Why not? Why not? How's the fire situation sucking? That's what that does. Oof. Oof. Put some fire in there. Got no health care over here. a medical facility across the way there has a death problem death and death and people people dying people dying people dying people trying if you ain't dying you ain't trying uh let's see here Pol policia policia is good garbage garbage is fantastic water okay we're all good things are upgrading we're all everything's looking up we're looking on up in the awesome department 
Looking up in the Austin department. Goddamn right we are. Alright. Heavy duty commercial because we're along the ocean front here. We'll throw down some high density residential to make some skyscrapers to look over the water. That's where we'll stop right there. We'll just stop. How about water? I knew it. Bring, bring, and we'll fill this bad boy in with something. With some. But this will be a nice little locals division. You know, we got the the golf course rocking. We got a, we got a lot of stuff going on here. That's good. We're gonna we're bringing in some residents into the neighborhood. To enjoy some lovely things. Just a little bit of light commercial down here. Nothing too nothing too crazy. But just enough to keep it working and spiffy and people are happy. Yes. Good, good, good. What else can we do over here? Some of the models that have been coming in over here are uh, pretty pretty cool looking. Just on... <laughs> just like, kind of don't fit into the motif. Like, oh, we got these futuristic things right next to some residential. Some low commercial. But you know what? That's what you're gonna get. That's what you're gonna get in a in a beautiful city such as this. Uh, let's fill in some of these with some palm trees because it just looks a little too bare. You're in paradise here, folks. We need to have we need to have trees, and we got to fill this in with some kind of park. I'll do that uh, off camera. As far as I say, like a park, I just mean like walkways and try to just make it look interesting. Make it like a little mini park, little minis. That way it doesn't look like this like uh, you have one city block but nothing on the center. It just looks like it's barren and doesn't look real. It doesn't look real. Someone please tell me what's real anymore. I don't I don't know what's real anymore. Let's see what we got. Uh well, there's nothing really built right there, so good. We'll separate that. And let's go to a little nutty. Let's throw in right here. We'll get a little bendy. Why not? Why not? Throw in some offices. Maybe throw in some high density residential over here. Over here, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, homie? I'm just gonna be filling in some stuff. Just kind of making it all look like it's an actual city. And then we're going to probably keep this a little separate. We'll build a couple things over here to, uh, to kind of accentuate the uh, the locals area. And then we're going to spread it on out. We're going to start finishing this skyscraper hub, I believe, in the next episode. But yeah. Industry's looking nice. No one needs any workers. Look at that. Nobody needs workers. It's a new thing in industry, man. Everybody needs workers, so you just make a giant area, low, resi low density residential, and everyone's happy. Buses. Fantastic. How's this looking down here? We're filling in some stuff. I guess we need to put, do we need to put any parks? I don't think we need to put any parks as of yet, because, uh, well. Let's put a tropical park. We're going to put a tropical park right here. Okay. So people can come and enjoy a little bit of beach, but most of this is just going to be kind of a uh, kind of nice stuff, you know, just rounding it out. Some high, some high uh, density residential cuz this looks like a, a place for nice high density residential zones to be going or uh, beach houses. So we'll spread Actually, you know what? That's it. Sporadic beach houses going along. We're going to get the uppity up the muckety mucks and that's going to basically lock up this entire circle. It's just low density residential beach homes. And then I think what we'll do is we'll cut off, that's what we'll do. We'll, we're gonna cut off the high rises, the high rises right here. That road right there is gonna be the cutoff. We're cutting them off. And then this is all going to be low density residential subdivisions. We'll build this up as well and this area up and then we'll be done with tropical paradise and you know it'll be a sprawling work of art that's right that's right 
I'm excited. I'm bummed out, but I'm like, I'm excited because, you know, we, I've been working hard on this bad boy, and uh, you've been watching, and I appreciate all, all the views and all the love that you've been giving me over the past, I would say, month or two months since I've been doing City Skylines, and it has been a wonderful time, and I'm happy that people have been downloading the map and trying their own Let's Plays. <coughs> I think it's super duper cool, super fantastic, super awesome, and, uh... Yeah, it's just been it's been a lot of fun. I really timer. What's up timer? I really enjoy playing this game and I really enjoy making videos for you guys and coming up like the the, the the artistry that goes into some of these builds. I mean People sometimes think oh, come on, man. It's just a video game I was like no not really because people are going into their uh, their modding site like their modding stations and stuff like that I don't know modding stations. I don't know what the programs that they use at blender and stuff like that and they're creating works of art in the game creating works of art in the game for you to enjoy and uh, I saw in the Steam community that apparently there's gonna be uh, I don't know about City Skylines but it started I guess a Skyrim I've never played Skyrim I've never been a Skyrim guy uh, I'm, 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 I'm I get it. I get the uh, the idea of it. I'm just not like I'm not one of those guys that can sit down and play Skyrim. I'm just not. No big deal. I'm not saying it's a terrible game. I'm not saying it's a bad game at all. I've never played it. But uh, apparently there are modders in there, and they're starting to do paid mod subscriptions. So if you get a guy, like say in City Skylines, hasn't gotten to City Skylines yet, but say there's a guy who just makes nothing but constant 3D assets and 3D models, and he decides that he wants to go uh, like a paid subscription kind of deal. Be like two ninety nine for something, but he has to have, and then two ninety nine, and then you get all of his assets thrown into your city skylines. The only problem with that is that the person has to have, for me to spend three dollars, has to have a buttload of assets for me to enjoy and download. Because if it's not worth it to me, then it's not going to be worth it to you to do it. But if there's, a, I mean, like the one guy Bumpa who does the. Uh, you know, the medical marijuana facility and buildings all throughout here. I can't even like tag some of these down, but he, oh, the lag is real. The lag, the FPS once you get into the city is a little much, but I have a bunch of assets from about three or four different fellas, ladies, gents, and um, it's pretty wild how, uh, say like that guy, he's got like 30 or 40 assets. And I would throw down two dollars, three dollars to download an entire set. Um, it all depends on what the subscription is, and it all depends on how good the assets are. I mean, if you're really good at what you're doing, man, keep it, you know, keep it rocking, keep it rolling. But uh, I think the the whole DLC thing is a little much. I know playing uh, Mortal Kombat, they released the game for sixty dollars, and then in a month you can pay five or six dollars and get five more characters. I was like, mm, it's still not worth it. I I, I actually despise. Mortal Kombat now because I've been editing with my buddy uh, the impressions on his channel. I've been editing the Mortal Kombat for his channel and just watching him play it makes me not want to play the game ever. <laughs> I'm like, mm, no, I don't think this is good enough for me. I don't, I, I don't, I don't think I want this for for me. And apparently the replayability on it is terrible. Like he played it for an entire 24 hours and then just is like, I'm good. I'm good on this game. Like I'm, it's a wrap. I'm done. I'm done with this game. That sucks, man. Pay sixty dollars and then you're done. Sixty dollar game, done. At least Madden, you can you can replay it over and over again, play different teams, start a new character, start to create something. Nope, not not with Mortal Kombat. Mortal Kombat sucks. Just not. A, I'm a fan, but I'm not a fan. So cool. Well, basically what we did today is we just filled in some areas, some little bendy roads, things like that, adding in the uh, the road and of course pop it in some go kart some go kart tracks the way you like it the way you need it the way you want it in your life so folks my name is diesel i design stuff in city skylines it was a relaxing episode today nothing too crazy just filling in some areas having a little chat with you it's good it's very good i gotta uh, just to end off in case someone's actually watching this all over the end i had a, a showcase on freedom network uh, I am a part of the Freedom MCN. If you want to be a part of a YouTube network, uh, they got a lot of different cool uh, 
perks of having of being in their network. If you want to check it out, check it out in the link in the description below. The Freedom tab underneath uh, Join Freedom. Not gonna have to join Freedom if you click that tab, uh, but it'll, it'll have you check it out. And I do get a little little bit of kickback to kickback on my channel. You know, if uh, you click it and you join, and it's free. It's free, and they take they take a lot of people. A good good community, good forums, good everything. So folks, all right. Done talking, done with the episode. My name is Diesel. I design stuff at City Skylines. If you like this video, go ahead and click like. If you want to see how the uh, Tropical Paradise uh, pops out in the future, go ahead and hit subscribe. New videos come out every single day. We have a new city coming out on Saturday via a live stream at noon. Take a look at that. Get ready for that, folks. Everyone have a good day, afternoon, evening, good night. Peace out, like, shout. And I will check you out right here again in Tropical Paradise next time. Let's get a good view. Let's get a good view of this. Why not? Hey guys. Oh, everyone's shopping, yay!